everybody and welcome. Today we're gonna be showing you our tour of Halloween. All the decor and some snacks of what we're gonna be doing for the day of Halloween. So because we are still in the coronavirus pandemic, um, I'm gonna try as much as I can for the little trick-or-treaters that are gonna be coming to our house to not have too much contact with us or with other people. So what I did is I did individual bags. So I got this bag from the dollar store, the Dollar Tree, and then I just fill it up with all kinds of goodies. There's so much chocolate in here. Then I put just a little bit of different chocolates and Skittles and all kinds of goodies. And then also a pencil so they can use it for their schoolwork. And the cool thing is I'm gonna put this in a table that we have where we have the scarecrows in the front. And I'm gonna put this in the front. So it's gonna look really cool. So everybody can just go ahead, grab their little bag and keep on going without having any contact. People that, all the kids that cannot eat candy and they need to eat, eat something more healthy, we're gonna then take the clementines and we're gonna just put a little face into that and that will be it. I'm gonna show you also a snack that I did. I have been doing now for two years in a row. The name of it is called the Strawberry Cheese Cream Pumpkin. Well, that's what I named it. You're, all you're gonna be using is just some cream cheese, and then you have your strawberries. Just, we're gonna cut them in little tiny pieces or blend it. We're gonna mix this thing together. To that, you can add either honey, stevia, and or brown sugar that's what i'm going to be using we're going to mix it all up then we're going to go ahead and put it in a mold i have this cute mold of pumpkins put it in the freezer for like an hour or so and then you have this little tiny pumpkin that looks so cute and pink and you don't need to put no color in it no nothing because the strawberry itself is going to give it that nice strawberry color. So let's go ahead and just put all the strawberries in here. Now it's done. Now we have the whole strawberries blended. It looks like a puree. Go ahead and mix up our strawberries. into the mold. So that's what we're gonna do. And once we filled up the mold, then we're gonna put it in the freezer for an hour. After an hour, we can go ahead and remove it. So now this has been in the freezer for a few hours. I totally forgot about them. So they have been standing in the freezer for a long time. So now we're just gonna go ahead and flip it and start removing it little by little. You can put a little bit of warm water around it, which I already did. And so now I'm gonna go ahead 
lift them up and I'm gonna start pressing in the middle and on the sides so they can come out completely without breaking that's what you want you want to have that face looking super cute and so we're gonna go ahead and press on the middle and on the sides as well middles and side and middle and side okay so that's our faces super cute and this is a very good alternative for a person that is in like a low carb diet which is what i usually eat during the week but lately i have been eating lots of goodies and candy and so if you want to have it low carb this was the cream cheese with the strawberry and instead of the sugar or honey just use then stevia splenda or mom take something that it will be very low glycemic index and there we go there you have it super nice looking funny faces of pumpkins so beautiful so let me show you the tour of the house so let me show you from the outside going in from the entrance so we just put this pathway and we need to do more but it has been raining non-stop so we have been doing little by little everything as a matter of fact it's raining a little bit tonight or well, today because it's already 7 a.m in the morning and it's still dark but look at all the colors it's just so beautiful still you can see that orange coming up from the different colors of the trees the maple trees are just amazing and we still have some of the blooms over here our beautiful Jolly and Justin they have withstand, been withstanding all the winds and all the rain but they have definitely got smaller from how they were before so as you can see it's raining a little bit right now and we put some lights over there so this would be a nice area for people to take pictures and then we put those little string of lights around the path so you know where you're going and then you meet up with the witches and they're telling you hey this is it this is where you're gonna have your trick or treat so we're gonna put a little table over here for people to take their candies so it's gonna be super cute and then on the top you can see that we have our pumpkins and the blue sign and our pumpkin and the blue sign and it flickers also that at night so we put that sometimes and then you have a projector light that comes on the top over there so during the night it looks really nice so let's go in inside and check also the inside because we have more lights in the inside us we need to put the rocks in this side that we haven't done that yet but you know guys lots of projects little by little we move into this home this house in december 2019 so we haven't even been in this house one year gonna be a year soon and so far we have done lots of projects so thank you for coming along with us so now let's go inside and we have a little tiny spider over here hi mr. spider hi mr. spider they're saying hello and the wreath that we put that has been with us for a few years I made that myself so let's go inside when you go inside, you can see that we have also some lights in here. So we like lights, lots of lights. So it has some lights in there. And then you can see that there's some lights projecting over there. And this is the inside over here. And there's some lights of string of ghosts hanging over there with a little cat, a black cat over there. And it says, Happy Halloween. And then we have some wreath. I'm gonna put the lights for you guys so you can see it better. But I just wanted you for you to see some of how it looks during the night. So then in this side, when you come in, you have the happy Halloween sign. You have also a little basket thing, um, you know, with a pumpkin. And then we have our little cat. More pumpkins in this side over here. More pumpkins over there and then you have the path going up that it leads you with a wreath in the center and you have another wreath in the center over there and a wreath over here that is always lighting up 
with the cross of Jesus in the middle because we are Christians in here and in here you can see that we have the center of the table that you guys saw how we decorated it and the Christmas tree as well so you can go ahead and check out that video if you want to see how we did the tree and how we did the center the mantle so in here we have lots of pumpkins over there you guys have seen the video as well of how we made our pumpkin napkins that they're full of goodies so those are the pumpkin napkins the different type of pumpkin napkins and you have seen that video so you can go ahead and check it out as well and we just put then the two trees over there uh, once it gets to november 1st i'm gonna start putting lots of decoration for christmas so i'm transitioning little by little and then we have that wreath in the middle over there and then when you go up you see that there's some projector of lights over there and that projection of light is where we're going now which is going to be in the living room so let's go over there and the, here is where you're going to be removing your shoes the, removing your shoes center because we don't like people to walk into the house with shoes on and so when you go in you can see that this is our living room you cannot see it in detail but it looks really good in here during the night and it's always changing pretty cool so let me just put on the light for you again so you can see the decorations that we have here so when you go into this side, we kept it very simple, we put the mantle and you know that I have a video of how we did the mantle and that I think is in the first, the second video, in the second video of the autumn decor, so in the second video of autumn decor, you can see the mantle, how we did it, and so we just added then the tombs over there and those little trees on the side. And you can see then the wreath that we have over there projecting from the upstairs into the mirror and that's because when you go into the catwalk upstairs and you go and don't mind that red that red wall that needs to be done we haven't had time to do that yet we're doing everything little by little in here so as you can see we put those three wreaths so in every middle section of the stairway you have one of those wreaths and they do light up as well um, unfortunately you cannot see it very clear here in the um, video but they do light up orange as well and we are getting ready and excited for December and when we're gonna be celebrating our the birth of Jesus and so we already have our little nativity scene already out so i'm excited for that and so we have now our pumpkins little orange pumpkins over there super cute they're so cute it is very close with our white pumpkins in the bottom in one of our videos um, where we were talking about the squash and also how to make the dry flower arrangement so this is still a flower arrangement hanging out strong over there looking super nice we're just gonna stay there in the middle and then here we just added a happy halloween sign with some pumpkins as well and this side we have not done much because we haven't again gone shopping to buy any furniture or anything so this is all a progress but you guys saw how we finished the floors because the floor was a different color like a red oak and we changed it then to the antique brown so you can go ahead and check out the before and after of our floors and so in this section we have a new member of the family and so i'm going to do a video of her soon so just keep an eye because it's amazing purple amazing amazing color and so we have our orchids about to bloom 
and we have then different color pumpkins because as you guys know i like different color pumpkins so this is a purple pumpkin and it has a great material i love the material it's like a felt really soft material and so you have then the, the tree over here that is always light up so let's go upstairs and check this out So we have one over there and as you can see in the front we also have a little pumpkin sticker thread that we put over there and then here in the catwalks then you have the wreath in the middle and a wreath over here on the side and then the wreath that you saw on the other side as well and the maple tree has been falling the leaves and it just looks so magical I just love October, this is my favorite month because of the season. I mean, the trees are changing and it just looks spectacular. You can see how gorgeous the colors are, are just wonderful. It still hasn't come out the sun yet. It is already almost 8 a.m. So, yeah, the nights are longer. That's the bad thing. But we are trying to make it as nice and cute as possible by having lots of lights and cozy decor. So this over here, we're going to put that uh, rock over here in the middle later on. And we have lots of more stuff that we have added. As you can see, but I'll do another garden walk another day. For now, I'm just showing you our beautiful decor. You can check the latest garden walk, you know, that we have our giveaway that we're going to be doing in our garden walk number 10. And I believe that we are so far in the garden walk 5. So you can go ahead and join in. There's only a few regulations of just a few rules, simple rules, which is just to subscribe to our channel, like the videos of the garden walk, and then remember the names and the nicknames of our plants and send me the list to my email so go ahead check out those videos if you want to be also um being part of the giveaway and get that wonderful box mailed to your home and we are all done thank you guys thank you everybody for coming to the channel checking out this video if you like this video go ahead and like this video and also subscribe to our channel we are a great community great family i love every single one of you and we have so much different content from home remedies to health and related content to decoration, do it yourself, all kinds of goodies. So come along and join in the community. Love you guys. Enjoy the miracles and have an awesome day. Happy Halloween. Bye.